Hey there, this is Julie Deneen from Fabulous Blogging and I'm getting a lot of questions after Monday's post um, where I talked about a new series called The Quick and Dirty where I answer questions that I'm constantly getting in email and one of the things that I brought up was WordPress spacing and how to deal with it. Um, so I'm just jumping on a hangout real fast to show you exactly how to deal with WordPress spacing. You may notice when you're in WordPress that you have trouble making lists or even worse it looks spaced correctly in the edit screen and then when you preview it or you publish it everything gets smushed together. So these are just some real simple solutions. I'm going to jump on screen share for you and you can see. Okay. So I'm just going to go in and I'm going to do um, a new post here and I just want to show you real quick what I mean. So you're here in the visual tab when you're writing something whenever you want a space just hit return. Now I know there are some people who do this they type and then they hit a shift return to make it smaller. Don't do that. It causes problems later on down the, down the line. So problem is that um, sometimes this messes up spacing. So here you are you're writing a post now, if in any point you have weird spacing issues, the first thing you can try is highlighting the text and hitting the erase. This will clear formatting, okay? Now, I'll show you what I mean. So if I've got this in heading one and I've got this in heading two, which if you notice when you hit the shift return, um, you can't put these in heading in separate headings because there's actually not a break there. So I'd have to go back and do just a straight enter or return like so and then I can go ahead and categorize these accordingly okay so when you highlight everything you hit the eraser that will clear formatting behind the scenes so if I have this linked it doesn't clear your headings but it clears like um, links um, I have to show you what I mean you can't see it because of the spell check. So if I go like this and I create a link, okay, and then I highlight it and I hit clear formatting, it's lying. It's not doing it. What it's done in the past is it clears um, links, it clears headings, but clearly the latest version of WordPress. But this is a good thing to do if, for example, let's take something from a Word document. So if you have um, a Word document, okay, so let's see, here's a Word document and it's in this strange formatting, okay, and you copy it and you paste it, this, this button will clear the formatting. You'll see what it just did, it just cleared the bold and the italic, okay. That's what the eraser does. So if the eraser doesn't fix your if the eraser doesn't fix your spacing, the next thing you want to do is look and see if there's any sort of strange HTML markup that you're seeing. And if there isn't, you can go back. Um, and here's the last thing. This is the most important part that I wanted to explain. Um, this button right here, paste as text. This is an amazing button, and the latest version of WordPress does it. So. Okay, so here I've got all this stuff here. This let me go to a different document. Let's see if I can find one. Let's go to recipes. Do I have? Here we go. This is kind of a formatted recipe. So if I copy this, and I just paste it in, it's going to automatically format it. Okay. Now if I want to clear the formatting. I hit that first and it takes away the bolds. Maybe I want to take away the numbering and I want to take away the bullets. Notice what you need to do is you need to grab everything and hit the button or hit it off. Don't try to do it by hitting shift enter. Um, but if ever you have a problem and it doesn't work right, all you have to do is click this paste as text. Paste is now in plain text mode. It will be placed as plain text until you toggle the option off. This will help if you are in Word. 
So now, as I've pasted it, you see they p it pastes in plain text. There's absolutely no formatting done whatsoever. You come over here, you'll see there is there's no HTML. Now, if you decide you want these things to be bullets, highlight everything, and you bullet it, you notice it puts the spacing, numbers, headings. Now, I'm not sure why the see that one. You have to hit a hard return if you want to to. Uh, and uh, this clear formatting, all it seems to do right now is being is take away the bold and italic, um, which it didn't used to. It used to take away links as well. But this plain text will stay on, and when you take it off um, and you paste something, so let's say I'm on Facebook or, hmm, actually let me go to like CNN.com, okay, and I want to, I want to pull. So can I pull any of this text? Grab it, copy it. This is okay. This is a great example. So this is all formatted text. It's formatted, um, really funky. In fact, if I preview it, you'll notice that it's maintained the same font, which is not a font that I use on my blog anyway. So, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to clear the formatting. That will take away the custom font. I'll show you that again. So you see all of this HTML in here, all this crazy stuff, font weight, font styles, all that, all that color. Using the eraser now I can show you better. We'll erase all of that, okay? If you wanted to, um, but it retains the links. But if you want all of that CNN text and you don't want any of the formatting, delete it. Make sure there's no code. Hit the paste as text button and it will place it completely um, just text. And if you want to create some more spaces, you can just delete and hit a straight enter. Um, and then if you wanted to make any of this in list format, you highlight it, hit either the bullets or that, or you can hit the quote, or you can indent it however you want. Um, okay, so those are the those are the um, options you have. There's also, oh, I'm sorry, I'm just realizing this. There was a pre-formatted heading in the old version of WordPress, but it looks like. It looks like they got rid of it, which explains why um, the formatting erasing button isn't working the same way as it used to. Um, so anyway, there you go. That's how it works. Um, use the erase button to clear bolds, italics, strange fonts, and strange colors. Make sure it's set to paragraph when you're working with text. Um, if you want to get rid of bullets and numbers, do it globally by highlighting. And if you want to paste something from a Word document, a Google Doc, or another web page, turn on the paste as text first. Okay, that's it. Um, have a great day. Bye.